government has described the late former Secretary to Cabinet, Dr. Roland Musiska, as a man who provided distinguished service with diligence to the country. National Guidance and Religious Affairs Minister Godfrida Smiley says as head of the public service, Dr. Msiska was instrumental in the formulation of many public service reforms. Metambuyu Katota has details in this report. A somber mood characterized the funeral service and burial of former secretary to the cabinet, Roland Musiska. People have described Dr. Msiska in many ways among them as a gallant public servant. The 62-year-old former secretary to the cabinet held many positions in government until his death. At the time of his death, Dr. Msiska served as Zambia Atomic Agency Director. National Guidance and Religious Affairs Minister Godfrida Sumaili was government representative at the funeral service and burial. Throughout his illustrious career in the public service, Dr. Msiska worked hard to ensure that government delivered to the expectations of the Zambian people. He continued to exhibit his impeccable intellectual cap capabilities, friendliness, and humility, even when he assumed the highest office of secretary to the cabinet of the Republic of Zambia. And Global Heart Church Pastor Christopher Kalima says people are remembered for the good things they have done and not for how many years they lived. All great men and women who passed on years ago, when we talk about them, we don't talk about the years, but we talk about what they did. Jesus lived only for 40, 33 years, yet what he did has changed the whole world, and we are who we are today because of what he did. Meanwhile, Dr. Msiska's widow, Glynis, in a tribute delivered on her behalf by a friend, Malita Kabai, described her late husband as a God-fearing man who put others before himself. Others who made tributes are Dr. Msiska's firstborn son, Gomeziani, and his sister, Caroline Musutu. We share everything. You made me the woman that I am. I will always love you and I will always cherish the memories we created together. He said to me that wherever he went to work, he carried with him the love of God, the love of knowledge, the love of the Zambian people, and humility. My brother was a peacemaker. One who would calm you down in stressful situations. A God fearing Christian who introduced to Christ of us family members and friends. Etambuyu Katota, ZNBC News, Lusaka. Remember to hit the like button, place a comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.